new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I'll give you a brief tour and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? Wonderful. Please follow me and don't wander off. The College of Winterhold has been a fixture in Skyrim for thousands of years. The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the Hall and the Archmage's quarters above that. While technically in charge of the College, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Unfortunately, we've had to implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. Our newest members are housed here, in the Hall of Attainment. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside, as others may be working on research or delicate experiments. Now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This bed and desk are yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Now, let's go back to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study sessions. Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. Tolfdir is likely already addressing the new apprentices. Go on in, and if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. We're just beginning. Please, stay and listen. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Sir, I think we all understand that fairly well. We wouldn't be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, my dear, of course. You all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true control, mastery of magic. It takes years, if not decades, of practice and study. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Please, please. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Eagerness must be tempered with caution, or else disaster is inevitable. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. 
Why not give us a chance to show you what we can do? You've been quiet so far. What do you think we should do? Well, your classmates certainly seem to disagree with you. Oh, don't listen to him. We can do it. Just give us a chance. All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. I'll teach you all a ward, and we'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? Would you mind helping me with the demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? That's all right. I can teach you a very basic ward, one that's enough for the purposes of this lesson. Now, if you'll just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the ward. Here we go. Over there, please, just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. You have to keep your ward up or else this won't work. I don't want to hurt you. Over there, please, just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. Hold still. Excellent work. Well, I think this is an excellent start. I'd like you all to continue practicing with wards, please. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthol nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. College is a bit of an oddity in Skyrim. Magic isn't something that's looked upon fondly here. New here too, eh? It's good to see another Nord. I feared I'd be the only one. Almost doesn't feel like Skyrim, being so far away from the rest of the world here. Magic is shunned by most. If it can't be swung over your head and used to crack skulls, most Nords want nothing to do with it. Magic is seen as something for elves and weaker races. All right, then. Skyrim could not be more different from elsewhere. But magic... Magic is the same no matter where you go. They won't say much, but most people have very strong opinions about the college and those that study here. Not at all. I consider it a blessing. My family was convinced coming here was a death sentence, or worse. It took years of insisting that this is what I'm meant to do. Well, look at the evidence. Nords generally don't trust magic, so it's not off to a good start. Throw in the Oblivion Crisis, which was caused by magic users, and the troubles now with the Aldmeri Dominion, who are elves and magic users. And finally, take the fact that the college is the only thing left standing after most of Winterhold was destroyed. It's all fairly damning. Until next time. You are new, yes? Have you mastered the expert level destruction spells yet? Ah, this is good. But Jezargo will know them first. It is good to finally be around mages who may be able to keep up with Jezargo. 
Oh, yes. Jezargo hopes to find things that will make him a more powerful mage here. Hopefully small things that fit inside pockets and will not be noticed if they are missing. Mages in Cyrodiil are all about politics. The Synod in the College of Whispers are too busy guarding secrets to bother to teach. Skyrim was not Gisargo's first choice, but Winterhold is removed from politics. Dedicated to study, this is the place for Gisargo to become great. There is much for Gisargo to be sure of. There is skill in magic, there is charm, and there is a strong will. Gisargo will be successful. Of this there is no doubt. Oh, but you are wrong. The only reason you could disagree is because you are losing so badly you cannot see it. All right, then. Skyrim could not be more different from elsewhere, but magic... Magic is the same, no matter where you go. Swift handing. Jazargo will go wherever he can to learn more. Oblivion itself, if need be. Mm-hmm. Khajiit are not known as mages, so Jazargo has much to prove. Swift handing. Jazargo can learn magic from these men and elves, but they cannot learn to be as dashing as he. Jazargo comes out on top. All right, then. Hmm? Mm-hmm. College is a bit of an oddity in Skyrim. Magic isn't something that's looked upon fondly here. I'd better get going. Nords don't trust magic or those that use it. Made it difficult for me growing up. All right, then. They won't say much, but most people have very strong opinions about the college and those that study here. Until next time. Don't expect the local Nords to take kindly to you once they find out you're from the college. Mm-hmm. Yes? Until next time. Enchanting services are one of the few things that keep us in touch with the rest of Skyrim. The local Nords may not like us very much, but they don't seem to mind having access to enchanted weapons and armor. I need some more supplies. Can you help out with that? <laughs>